Finally home on a beautiful Friday. We forgot to put that mulch in the yard yesterday, so let's go get changed and go do that really quick before we head out for the night. Ooh, girl, let me show you in my trunk. So we were getting rid of this mulch at work, so I brought it home. Oh, it is dirty. Yeah, it's dirty. That's dirty okay. mulch. Yeah, get that weeding. We're gonna put some mulch down here, so we gotta get all these weeds out of here. Yay. Note to self, don't bend down to do gardening work on a day where you had a leg-heavy workout. This is not fun. So we may have been bested by these little teeny tiny things right here because there's so many of them. This would take us years to pull them all out. So I think we're just going to cover them up and hope that the mulch like drowns them out and they die or they have no sunshine and they die. I thought this was the heavier bag. I was just standing on it. <laughs> there's so much space over here. That's what I was saying. I don't think we have enough. Yeah. Well, the good news is that it kind of like blends in. So... Yeah. If we can't cover everything, I don't think it really matters. If we spread it out like super thin, maybe nobody will notice. The sky looks like it's tie-dyed. It looks awesome. Farmer Timmy was his name. E-I-E-I-O. Take a picture, it'll last longer. I, I did on accident. I just mm -hmm. took a picture. And here's all the weird stuff that was in the mulch. Yay. What do you guys think? I think it looks pretty good. Good job. We like to recycle stuff. This was trash, and now it's our front yard. <laughs> Trashy. What do you think? I had to figure out how to use it. Oh no. Yeah, yeah, it looks brand new. It does look brand new. Just needed a bath. But you're reeling up our sweet pink hose. <laughs> and it's it peeing was. all over the driveway. Ooh, the cops. She did not like that. Uh-oh. Now they're yelling at our neighbors. And then we hang it in our garage. Like art. Art. Yeah, we do have art. Art. Operation get a song stuck in Jen's head while she's editing is a go. Tell me why I never want to hear you say I want it that way. I never want to hear you say Girl, I your eyelashes want this it. way. Ow. <laughs> Jen was totally writing a happy birthday card to Barb. I spelled her name and wrong. It came out as Bab. Oh my god! I also spelled birthday wrong. Did I? No. <laughs> oh. What the heck kind of boat is that? It's got fancy rims on it, that's for sure, but what's this thing coming out the back end? We're going down to this bar called The Hideaway for one of my co-workers, and it's her birthday. Happy birthday, Barb. Happy birthday, Barb. For your Barb. birthday, we got you... Can you see it? We got you a birthday cupcake from Four Rivers. The sweet shop. Yay, our favorite place. It is the sweet shop inside of Four Rivers. It's the best. I just hope that that cupcake makes it there because that is one delicious looking cupcake. Our cheat day's not until tomorrow. Or wait, no, it's Sunday. Sunday. <laughs> we got two whole days. Aww. I think after all that working out and the yard work that we did, we might deserve some sort of cheat. I don't know. Tomorrow, we're going to Disney. Yeah, we're gonna work off all these crazy calories, so we should cheat tonight. It's gonna be so hard to be at Disney. We'll go and we'll say that it's our birthday, so we get free desserts and stuff like that, but yeah, it's gonna be hard not to get free desserts. I hit record like such a long time ago. I don't know if you guys can see this car up here. Oh, the, what, one burnt out brake light? Yeah, he, we're going on 70. 70, and he's like tripling our speed. He was going like 200 miles an hour. 88, no, 200 miles an hour. I'm trying to zoom out. Yeah. Epic zoom. In a dramatic change of events, that guy is now driving exactly two traffic laws. What does that mean? Like he's following, obeying traffic laws. Oh, I thought you meant like the number two. Like number he's... two. <laughs> like, uh, okay. Only two traffic laws. <laughs> I didn't know what he meant by that. You guys need to stop speeding. You're going to get a ticket. It's a Friday night, man. Holy cow. So we just passed by a billboard for Paul McCartney. He's going to be here tomorrow and Sunday. Well, I guess today. And Sunday. Also playing a free concert downtown today, Saturday, is Brett Michaels. It's gonna be a sweet middle-aged rocking day. I wouldn't compare Brett Michaels and Paul McCartney, would you? Heck no. I think Brett Michaels is much younger than Paul McCartney. He he probably is, but he looks quite old to me. <laughs> yeah. Somebody on the radio station that's putting on the free concert show, they were announcing it and they're like, ooh, it's gonna be hot this weekend. Hopefully Brett Michaels takes his shirt off and I'm like, oh, oh, oh. Keep your shirt on, Brett. It's gonna be our first trending topic. Hashtag keep your shirt on, Brett. Yeah, keep it on. 
Hashtag. Is Brett Michaels only gonna sing Brett Michaels songs? Or is he gonna sing Poison songs? If I were Brett Michaels, I would probably sing mostly Brett Michaels songs, but I have to throw in a few Poison songs in there to keep people interested. Are you allowed to do that though? Because remember when uh, Steve Perry left Journey and then he like he wasn't allowed to sing any of the Journey songs? But he was still allowed to sing Steve Perry Journey songs, wasn't he? I, I don't know. I know he was allowed to sing Oh Sherry, I love Hold on, hold on. I know he could sing that because he released that as Steve Perry. Oh. Did you know that? No, I didn't. Yeah, but now it's a uh, some guy from the Philippines that sings that for guy's, Journey. Guy's he, got they, great hair. They found him on YouTube. You could be the next lead singer of Journey. See this furniture store right here? It's really cool. One time we went there and it was also a bar. It's called yeah. the Imperial. It was neat because you got to sit on their furniture that they were trying to sell. It was a bad I, idea. Yeah, I think that's not really a good idea. <laughs> but it was really nice furniture. We're totally in like hipster town USA. Hipster like town. I've already seen 15 guys wearing tight pants and tank tops. It's gonna be a good night. We just got to the hideaway and uh, there's no parking. But you can't, you, you have to get all the way into the parking lot before you realize that there's no parking. And it's hard to get out. Cause there's like literally not a parking lot. So cool. Best parking lot ever. But they do have sweet like girl artwork. Yeah, look at that. Heck Ooh, yeah. pretty awesome. Now we're downtown. I like these houses. I love it when they have these big porches on the outside. I like this sweet tree with all these lights hanging from it. It's not a real tree. It's, it's like, like made out of two by fours. Yeah, and the lighting, the lighting fixture things are cool. Heck yeah. Let's take it. Oh, the whole thing. Yeah. Come on. Shortest night out ever. Sorry we didn't film very much, but it's just kind of everybody that I work with. So that might be a little bit awkward for me to be like, hey, everybody, you're on the internet drinking. Not so good for your job reputation. Also, we were only there for about maybe an hour, 45 minutes because we have to come home and go to sleep because tomorrow we're going to Disney with little Rob. You guys know little Rob, right? Go subscribe. YouTube.com slash EYE Lil Rob. All right, guys, let's get to bed so that we can wake up early in the morning and go ride Space Mountain and such. I'll see you guys tomorrow. Now it's time to pay the price.